Hey guys, welcome back to Colorful Crafting with Holly, and I'm here today with another quick unboxing for you. As you see, we have another kit from Diamond Art Club to get into, and this is a very special one that I'm super excited to show you guys. It's a, one of the brand new releases from Diamond Art Club. But uh, before we get into that, a um, couple little things to get out of the way. I'm in my room, and um, I'm currently being stalked by the lovely Miss Queen Sophie, my rescue cat, um, she likes to pop in every once in a while when I'm doing unboxings because she likes to know exactly what's going on because this area of my bed with the, with the gray blanket is considered her domain and she doesn't like to have um, foreign objects in her area. So you might see a little fluff ball pop into the frame every once in a while. But having said that, let's get right into it today. We are doing an unboxing <laughs> for what is arguably the biggest canvas I've ever gotten, let alone considered working on. Um, and I thought Sneaky Cat was big. I'm not sure if this is this. I think this is longer than Sneaky Cat, but I could be wrong. But I'm talking, and I don't know if you're going to be able to see this because the, um, the sticker on the box is actually really small. But it is Train of Dreams by Ron, Ran, I always want to call him Ronald, Randall Spangler. It is round and it is 68 by 18. That is 173 centimeters by 46 centimeters. Yeah, I don't even think this is going to fit across the width of my bed, but we're going to make it work. So I don't know if I told you guys, but I kind of went on a buying ban. And uh, when I saw this one kind of blew that out of the water because um, I'm also a cross stitcher and Heaven and Earth Designs, the full coverage pieces, they have many, 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 many Randall Spangler designs and this was one of my favorites and I was super excited to see that they were turning it into a diamond painting. So anyway, enough chit chat. Let's get into the good stuff. I did remove the cellophane because I just find it makes it easier to... to um, Get everything out first of all we have the typical diamond art club um toolkit which i think everybody and their mother has seen at this point even if you've never actually ordered one yourself we've got some baggies oh goodness and we've got two hearts of wax a scrunchie a squishy rather <laughs> um a regular diamond pen and I believe that's a four placer in the bag. I'm actually surprised that they didn't give you two um, toolkits with this one since it's so big, but whatever. Um, okay. Oh, good Lord. All right. So this kit is actually um, special because uh, over on Facebook, there is actually going to be a Spangler, what is it called? Uh, Spangler-a-thon? No, drag Draglings. Oh my goodness, I will find out. <laughs> Maybe be a little bit more prepared next time, Holly. I'll find out the name of the group um, that is running the um, the <laughs> the paint along, diamond paint along, whatever you want to call it. Um, it starts on July 1st and runs through July 31st, and you have to pick um, a diamond painting that is by Rand Randall Spangler. I almost called him Ronald again. <sighs> and so since it's something, it has to be something that you start on the 1st of July. I can't use my Canine Christmas or so many books, so little time, because I've already started working on them. So this is the one that I'm going to use for that event <laughs> that I don't know the name of. Um, this is the the sticker. Again, not very bright. You can't really see anything on that. But this is huge. Goodness, I haven't even taken it out of the bag yet, and I can tell it's huge. Oh lord! Oh god! It's so big it doesn't even want to come out of the plastic. All right. So, there's the image. 
See how huge, there's a lot going on in this image, but I love the draglings. I just, I think they're so adorable. And I haven't seen one um, image, whether it be through Heaven and Earth Designs or Diamond Art Club that I have not loved. So, and here are the stickers for when you kit up. This has 57 colors, it is a round. And I believe there's a few ABs. I think there's two ABs in this. Yes, two ABs. Okay, so there you go. Oh my goodness. This, these are all the drills, you guys. I know there's a glare. And once again, I don't take them out of the bag because then they go everywhere and I like to keep everything as neat and organized as possible until I start working on the kit, which I am going to start kitting this up before I go back to work on Tuesday. So I have everything good to go for the beginning of the month. But, and if you've never gotten a Diamond Art Club kit before, you know, or um, I should tell you that their canvases are really amazing. They're soft, velvety, they have the scalloped edges so there won't be any fraying. And it's also poured glue, which means that you can roll them backwards without having to worry about messing up the adhesive. So let's get this done. Oh my God, it goes on forever. And this is definitely going to hang over the side of my bed. Holy shit. Oh my God. All right, you guys ready? Okay. <laughs> Holy crap. I mean, first of all, it's it's absolutely stunning what you can see of it. And here comes Sophie. <laughs> oh, she's like, dude, that's too big. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, so um, little uh, sorry for moving the camera around. Um, I'm a little overwhelmed actually. I knew it was big, but it's taller than I am. Um, so, okay, we have the moon over here and some books, we've got the train, we've got one of the adorable draglings right here, we've got the sun taking a nice snooze, we've got the teapot and the cookies down at the bottom. I'm going to shift this over a little bit so you can see more of the image. We've got more books, and... I'm not sure what this is. Let me look at the image. Oh, that's <laughs> that's more cookies. And then we have another draggling sleeping in the car, a birdhouse, more books. Jeez, Lord. <sighs> We've got a picture of what looks like Santa Claus. I'm not sure. <laughs> another teacup and some toys and Holy mackerel, this thing is huge. I have no idea how long this would even take me to finish. Wow. Um, as usual, the um, drill field is extremely clear, as you can see. And it's very hard to try and manipulate this in a way where you can see things. So let's look at the, the um, symbols, the legend. I am looking at it through the viewfinder. Everything looks pretty normal. I don't see any symbols that should give me any problems. And yeah. Okay. <laughs> Let's do the usual test for stickiness. Sticky, very sticky. Let me look at the actual drill field. Everything is very, very clear. I gotta say, if you say nothing else about Diamond Art Club, the one thing you can always say is nine times out of 10, 99.9% .9 of the time, you will never have a problem with um, blurry symbols in their canvases. They're always top-notch. I'm a little speechless right now, you guys. I gotta admit. <laughs> I knew it was big, 
not really prepared for how big this is. It's gorgeous. It's going to be a lot of fun to work on. I'm thrilled that it's a round because I think if this was a square, even though I love the image, I don't think I would have been able to uh, talk myself into getting it because I, I'm not the biggest fan of squares. Um, <laughs> so that's pretty much it, you guys. Let me know what you think. Did you get this one? Is it on your wish list? Um, how would you handle a beast such as this? I think I will have to do it sideways, roll it up, put it on my um, tilting easel, and uh, just try and attack it that way. So leave me your, your comments and suggestions in uh, the box below. Uh, yeah, like I said, I'm kind of speechless right now, which doesn't happen very often. So thanks so much for watching, you guys. And uh, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the little bell so you'll know every time I upload a video. And until next time, you guys, happy diamond painting and holy moly, Batman, that's a big canvas.